just a quick update on the mini quad project and let me apologize for the noise in the background that's the maker bot actually printing another frame I'm gonna do a test uh, with a different motor but I'll post that soon if you'd watched the previous video you'd notice that when we spun up uh, the multi we this right front prop was not spinning properly and the quad just didn't behave as expected when uh, giving full throttle some of you had asked had I gone through an ESC calibration and I had calibrated each one of these individually by hooking up the ESC directly to the receiver without power, putting my throttle all the way up, giving power to the ESC and then throttling down. So the, the standard uh, ESC calibration routine, at least for the uh, Turnigy series ESCs. So that, I had done that, that didn't work. And so I just wanted to quickly show you the ESC calibration routine specific to the multi wee board where we can load some a special version of the firmware on and do an all-in-one calibration and it's actually yielded better results but still uh, not what I would expect and not enough to uh, get us airborne. For starters we need to go ahead and hook up our programming cable So our cable is connected and we need to power the quad. Okay, so we're looking at the multi wee firmware and I want to point out that this is actually version uh, 2.1 of the firmware. firmware. I could not uh, locate this command in version 2.0, but what needs to happen is there's this ESC calibrate cannot fly and you want to uncomment that it's actually in the config.h file and next we'll go ahead and save compile and upload to our multi wee board okay so I'm going to upload one thing you'll notice now is in doing this you're gonna hear the ESC's beep and I have my hand on the quad for a reason because you'll notice that the the props spin up and after about 10 seconds uh, you'll see a little LED blink and I've also read that there's a buzzer that goes off if you have the buzzer uh, configured so the manual actually points out this is a tiny quad if you're doing you know 450 size or anything like that you definitely want to remove your props uh, when doing this calibration and one last tip before we give it a test make sure that your battery is connected initially I had done this with just my board powered and I had forgotten that the battery wasn't connected and those ESC's need to be powered up for uh, the calibration sequence to work and the last thing that needs to happen is you need to comment out this ESC calibration cannot fly line and then re-upload the firmware so I'm gonna upload with that line commented out and now you can hear our ESC's beeping uh, basically because the transmitter and the receiver aren't communicating our ESC's are now calibrated with the multi wee ESC calibration routine so I'm gonna go ahead and spin up the motors that motor spin up maybe? Come on, that will not spin. Need a little. So the multi wee ESC calibration has definitely improved things. Just to rule out any motor issues, I connected this uh, front left motor directly to the receiver, and you can see we can get pretty good throttle on that guy so right now where I am is you know potentially an issue with the multi wee board maybe undersized motors and props and I'll follow up with a video that shows using this uh, Turnigy 1811 2900 kV motor thanks to several of you guys that have suggested this I'm pretty excited about it and I'll go into more details of just why I think it's a much better motor than the ones I'm using right now so until then, I uh, appreciate all the comments and please keep them coming and thanks for watching.